Welcome back to my channel. I am the iOS and you guys are my humble emojis. And it's time that I give you guys an update. Today I'm going to be reviewing an e-juice by Bazooka Sour Straws. This specific one, it's really weird because it's by two different people. What? What? It's Pineapple Peach by Bazooka Sour Straws by Tropical Thunder. This specific e-juice is also a 70 VG over 30 PG. I know I really like to go for those. I don't know why. It's just that I'm leaning more towards the juice vapors. I like to do tricks. I'm sorry. And the flavor and the clouds is just what I want. Don't be mad. It's what I want. And if you wanted it, that means that's why you're here. So that means you want it. So yeah, yeah. You want it. So just like every other vape review, I'm going to be doing this one on the Smoke Mag Kit as well. The only reason that it is my go-to, I know I'm really cringy, is because I'm only 20 years old and I wasn't able to get a brand new mod right before they switched the law to 21 in my state, so... <clears throat> sorry, not sorry. So without further ado, I'm going to try to give this a few good pulls and see what happens. I'm actually going to start on 100 this time. And the reason being is because last time I started on 75 and I was like, oh, okay, and I went up to 100. So let's work our way down this time. I want to pull on a juice at the maximum, but at the same time, I'm like, okay, let's not blow out my RDA as well as the mod. So let's just try to get this pull going for it. As always, there's a little bit of startup. So get it going. And let's try it. Mmm. Mm, that gives me a lot of flavor. Hold on. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to try to hit that one again. I'm not tasting tropical. You lied to me! <gasps> ah! No, just kidding. The only reason that they're actually called Tropical Thunder is because the type of fruit flavors that they have is tropical fruits. I mean, all fruits are darn near tropical except for apples, to be honest. But no, it actually does give me more of a pineapple flavor than it does a peach flavor. I do taste the peach, however, it I think the sour aspect is what's actually leaning it more towards the pineapple. Because pineapple, if nobody knows, the actual fruit itself does start off very sour. You have to get it at the perfect time for it to be really sweet. Which I don't understand the whole pineapple making things sweet thing. Don't worry about that. If you're under 18, don't listen to this video. Don't watch it. And don't, you shouldn't be vaping anyway. Disclaimer, you shouldn't be vaping unless you are 21 or 19 in some states. So let me try one more pull at 100 and then I'm going to get you at 75. Oh yeah, that's that good stuff. Now this does give me a good, nice pull to my throat. However, it's not really doing it for me. I wonder why. It's a good thing that I got it in zero nicotine as well. Generally, I like to get them in zero nicotine, but if I get it off of somebody and it has something like 0.3, then I'm not gonna complain because it's only 0.3. It's not gonna, I'm not gonna be addicted to 0.3 if I'm not addicted to anything to begin with. So let's go to 75. Here we are at 75. And without further ado, oh, okay. Now, when you're at a lower one, this seems to be the perfect spot if you don't want flavor. Sorry about it, but this is probably going to work the best on a mod that probably has a 100 watt minimum or maximum maybe 
but I don't recommend going at 75 unless it could have been a fluke, at which case, that's why I tried Mother once. Now this time I actually did taste the peach more than I did the pineapple. Not sure why the wattages would change it into flavor unless they felt like, oh yeah, let's make low wattage peach and high wattage pineapple because who doesn't like sour pineapples? I can't be too mad at it though. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure that you give that like button a friendly old nudge, you know? Turn it blue. Go ahead. Turn it. Turn it blue. Also, this vape juice is actually $27.99, but I always try to link you guys to the best things, you know? I'm not sponsored by anything, but, you know, I should be, you know? eLiquids.com, Mad Vapes, Dash Vapes, Good Guy Vapes, you know, sponsor me, bro. <laughs> but I always do try to link you guys to the cheapest one. However, the cheapest one it does come with 0 0.3 milligrams of nicotine. So just a fair warning, if nobody wants the nicotine at all, that is the cheapest one that you can get. Sorry about it, but it only comes in that. It's actually $12.99, but you can get one for $15.99 and you'll have the choice and the option. But you can also always visit your local vape shop, Dash Vapes, Good Guy Vapes, Mad Vapes, or any other vape shop in the vicinity and be like, hey, I want a hundred milligrams of nicotine. They probably won't give it to you, but I mean, you could always ask them to put your own custom amount of nicotine in there. So that's always a good key. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I highly do appreciate it. Make sure we get this video to at least two likes. <laughs> I know that is horrible, but let's make sure we get it to two likes. Just because, well, I want two likes. If you want to get it to more, Get it to 200 views. If you can get this video to 200 views, it will be a key. Okay? If you get this video to 200 views, let me tell you, I can upload a new one tomorrow. Tomorrow. To whenever, tomorrow, whenever, it's 200 views. How about that? Or if you try to get it to 200 views in a month, you're probably going to already get another video by then. <laughs> but I am the iOS. You guys are my homo emojis. And I will update you guys later. See ya.